Happy Easter weekend 2024. I've got 20 questions for you. Hop it around on bunnies. This is Trivia with Buds. What it be and welcome to a bonus episode of the Trivia with Buds podcast. I'm your host, Ryan Buds. Thanks for checking out the show and happy, happy Easter. Hope you're having a good time. Maybe driving to grandma's house for a big Easter dinner. Maybe you are on your way to church or maybe you are listening to this on a non-Easter weekend way in the future or uh, just in the middle of some random week and you're like, I like bunnies. <laughs> Whatever it is, I'm glad you found the show. Uh, this show comes out Monday through Friday. There's 1,700 episodes to listen to whenever you want. Uh, hit subscribe so you never miss a new episode. You can join our fan community at patreon.com slash trivia with buds. Get the show ad free for a dollar a month, 12 bucks a year. Pretty awesome deal. And uh, check out my Etsy page for instant trivia downloads if you want to host trivia at home or at a special event and you need some St. Patrick's Day trivia or some movie trivia or some the years 2000 to 2010s trivia. I just put that one up. Uh, Go check it out. Etsy.com slash shop slash trivia with buds. Linked in the show notes as well for easy clicking. Today's episode is a fun one on bunnies. I'll give you a quick Uh, description of a fictional bunny, and you tell me who we're talking about. Um, And uh, some of these are easier than others. There's 20 of them, so uh, about 10 more than our usual episode. So have fun with this, and uh, we'll jump into it in just a second. But we've got the letter H for Scategories, our warm-up game. So think of things that start with the letter H in these three categories. Methods of transportation, items in a kitchen, and flowers. Methods of transportation, items in a kitchen, and flowers, all starting with H. Listen for my three episodes, my three episodes, my three answers at the end of the episode, along with a fun fact of the day, which is about the first vending machine. Get ready for that. We're all warmed up. We're ready to go. And we're jumping in to bunny trivia. Here we go. It's famous bunnies, question number one. Your clue, hides eggs on a Sunday. Number one, hides eggs on a Sunday. Number two, what's up, Doc? Number two, what's up, Doc? Number three, Marjorie William, beloved children's book. Marjorie William, beloved children's book. Number four, chocolate company mascot that clucks. Chocolate company mascot that clucks. Number five, he keeps going and going and going. Number five, he keeps going and going and going. Number six, created by Beatrix Potter. Created by Beatrix Potter. Number seven, here comes blank hopping down the bunny trail. Here comes blank hopping down the bunny trail. Number eight, he's late for a very important date. Number eight, he's late for a very important date. Number nine, female Looney Tunes character. Number nine, female Looney Tunes character. And number 10, Arthur's postcard sending friend. Arthur's postcard sending friend. Number 11, who framed blank blank? Who framed blank blank? Number 12, knows Winnie the Pooh. Knows Winnie the Pooh. Number 13, part vampire from children's book series, part vampire from children's book series. Number 14, chocolate milk spokesman, chocolate milk spokesman. Number 15, trickster rabbit from the Uncle Remus stories, trickster rabbit from the Uncle Remus stories. Number 16, blank are for kids, silly blank. 
blank are for kids, silly blank. Number 17, Field Mice Tormentor of Nursery Rhymes. Field Mice Tormentor of Nursery Rhymes. Number 18, Puka from Eponymous Movie. Puka from Eponymous Movie. Number 19, member of Star Fox's team. Member of the Star Fox team. And number 20, friend of Bambi. Friend of Bambi. Those are your 20 clues and questions on Famous Rabbits. We'll be right back with the answers to those 20 questions after this. Go have some eggs. We are back with the answers to Famous Bunnies. Let's see how you did. Number one, hides eggs on a Sunday, of course, is the Easter Bunny. Easter Bunny. I hope some of the young listeners got that one right away. Number two, What's Up, Doc? Bugs Bunny. Number three, Marjorie William Beloved Children's Book is the Velveteen Rabbit. Velveteen Rabbit. Number four, Chocolate Company Mascot that clucks. I forgot about those commercials way back in the day with the clucking rabbit. Uh, The Cadbury Bunny. Cadbury Bunny. He Keeps Going and Going and Going. The Energizer Bunny. Created by Beatrix Potter. Peter Rabbit. Here comes Peter Cottontail hopping down the bunny trail. Hippity hoppity Easter's on its way. He's late for a very important date was the White Rabbit from Alice in Wonderland. Female Looney Tunes character Lola Bunny in Space Jam. And Arthur's postcard sending friend was Buster from the PBS animated show Arthur. Those were the first 10. Uh, 11 through 20, who framed Roger Rabbit? Uh, Knows Winnie the Pooh is just Rabbit, the yellow rabbit from Winnie the Pooh. Part vampire from book series Bunicula, which I remember the cover of at my grade school library. Uh, Chocolate Milk Spokesman was the Nesquik Bunny. Trickster Rabbit from the Uncle Remus Stories is Br'er Rabbit. Uh, Silly Rabbit Tricks are for Kids. Field Mice Tormentor of Nursery Rhyme Little Bunny Foo Foo. And Puka from Eponymous Movie. This was the only one I was like, what does this mean? The answer is Harvey. And I Googled it to see what was going on. And it's a 1950 film. And it says, Elwood P. Dowd is an amiable but eccentric man whose best friend is an invisible six foot, uh, three and a half inch tall white rabbit named Harvey. So that was uh, what that was a reference to. Very random amongst this list. Member of Star Fox's team is Peppy Hare. That was also a tough one. And friend of Bambi to close it out, nice and easy, Thumper. So there you have it, 20 random rabbits for you on Easter weekend 2024. Hope you had a great time playing along. Hit subscribe so you never miss another episode. 1,700 to listen to whenever you're bored in the car or walking the dog or on the treadmill. Uh, fact of the day, first vending machine was located in Egypt, and it did not have Coca-Cola in it. It dispensed holy water uh, a long, long time ago. So the first vending machine was located in Egypt and dispensed holy water. If you didn't know that, now you know. And your letter for today was H. We had methods of transportation. I'm going to say helicopter. Items in a kitchen, perfect for this weekend, a nice Easter ham. And flowers, hyacinths. Thanks for listening. Thanks for telling a friend. And we'll see you next time for more trivia with Buds. Cheers. (laughs) 